So House or Homes and Gardens, Homes and Gardens magazine has just come out with an article about the Deacon Duchess of Sussex's home, their front porch in particular. And they are talking about how they, the Duke and Duchess of Sussex, are all about simplicity, you know, prioritizing simplicity. And I couldn't agree more, you know. Not only are they trying to live a life of simplicity and positivity, but you can also see it in their aesthetic and their ethos, their business ethos, as well as their personal ethos. And in their homes, according to Homes and Garden, um, the Megan's new lifestyle brand, American Riviera Orchard, um, has emerged as one of the most talked about launches of the year. And that's true. It does get a lot of press. And some of it is, is, is not, you know, very nice. But a lot of it, I would say most of it, is very positive. And everybody is waiting for all the wholesome products and ideas that uh, the Duchess will share from her Montecito home. I don't know if she will be doing it from her Montecito home. I suspect maybe, I don't know. I don't know. One has to wait and see what she does. But uh, I wouldn't be surprised if she does it in, you know, a nearby home or a studio or something like that just to protect her privacy and that of her family and her children, you know. So she has like a little sort of office that's called American um, Riviera Orchard. And she goes there and it is just this, maybe maybe it's like a, a small miniature version of her own home. I don't know. But it's like an office, but it's not an office, if you know what I mean. So it's an office, but it has a dining room. It has a kitchen. It has an office area. Oh, that would be so cute. And she goes there and she films, you know, so there's a filming room that she films for the show. So she has like a set. I suspect it's going to be a set. and Maybe the set will be structured to sort of look like her Montecito home to some extent, including all of the simple touches that are referenced by homes and gardens, like her front porch and different things like that. Because I don't think filming in her own home would be the best idea, you know, under the circumstances. Better to have a set somewhere and, um, you know, special pots and pans for that project, special American Riviera Orchard or Arrow, not American, yeah, Arrow, Arrow products, you know, and yeah, it's, it's going to be wonderful, I can't, I just absolutely cannot wait, but what else did Homes and Gardens say, so it says how she gave us a glimpse of her kitchen which is um a farmhouse very french style kitchen but with a california touch of course and they talk about the sort of indoor outdoor feel to her home and the natural color palette like natural stone um beige palette that i just i just think is you know so beautiful and, um, yeah, I can't wait to see all the products, you know, the especially the kitchen products, the towels, the tablecloths, the plates, the cutlery, the glasses, the decanters, all of the things that she will do that is at once simple and, and also artistic at once modern but with sort of a a retro vibe I don't know I'm not even sure but I know that it's going to be absolutely stunning right (laughs) it's going to be absolutely beautiful and just keep it simple and keep it just you know wholesome and you can't go wrong 
Duchess, <laughs> Duchess of Sussex. Anyway, I am very tired. I still have a few things on my to-do list, but it's the ungodly hour of 9.45 p.m. And I'm way past my bedtime, but the sun set quite late today. I mean, at 7 o'clock, there was still light outside, which was the first, I think, in a long time. So it means that, you know... <sighs> summer is coming and um, I can stay up a little later, but I am very tired. I've made about, I would say seven videos today and I still didn't get through all of the videos on my list. <laughs> I wanted to do them all today so that I don't have to do anything tomorrow and I can focus on something else because, you know, I'm not really getting much more done than videos these days. And it, it's, you know, other things start to pile up, unfortunately, but yeah, that's not your problem. It's my problem. So homesandgardens.com has this new article on the Duchess of Sussex about her sim simple sort of aesthetic for her home and her front porch and her gardens and so on. So if you want, you can check that out. So yeah, see you in the next one. If you're not subscribing, definitely hit that subscribe button. I need your help i need your support to grow the channel and certainly going around and getting all this news about megan and harry for you it takes a lot so if you like it definitely show me that you like it by hitting the subscribe button liking the videos sharing the videos and definitely coming back to see more videos okay have yourself a wonderful and positive day get back into a positive frame of mind and see you in the next one. Take care. Bye.